For making cauliflower fritters, first of all, we'll start with adding salt in a boiling water, in which I'm going to parboil the cauliflower. I've taken cali cauliflower florets. Now we are going to parboil them. This is how the parboiled cauliflower will look. I'm making tzatziki sauce here. It goes well with all the Greek dishes. Even you can pair it up with some Indian dishes also. And it tastes great with the even toasted pita bread. So here I have taken about a cup of yogurt, which I have already strained, and now I am whisking it to make it even smoother. Now it's almost smooth and pureed. I am going to add chopped cucumber, salt to the taste, two teaspoons of tahini salt. Mix everything together. And I'm finally topping it with some more chopped cucumber, some chopped flat leaf parsley, and finally a little bit of olive oil. Tzatziki is ready. So I have already parboiled and cooled the cauliflower, and I have chopped it into small pieces. Now we are going to add one whole egg in this. If you don't eat eggs, you can add corn flour and some white flour. As I am using egg, so I am adding one one tablespoon of corn flour, egg, salt to taste, and some Parmesan cheese. Finally, some fresh cracked black pepper, cilantro, coriander leaves. Just whisk everything together. And we'll bind it all with the bread crumb. Now add two tablespoons of bread crumb. Mix it all. Now our mixture for cauliflower fritter is ready, and I'm going to make fritters out of it. Now heat up a non-stick pan and add about two to three tablespoons of olive oil. Roll the pan to coat it well, and let the oil heat up. Now oil is heated up. Drop this much size of batter. Flatten them, flatten them with a spatula, or you can do it with your hand if you are experienced enough. But if you are starting to cook, I would suggest use the flat side of the spatula. Now, one side they are cooked. Flip them over. Cook them from other side as well. When you are cooking from the other side, just press them so that the surface below is so the surface below is smoother. That will make cooking faster and it will look better also. Now the fritters are cooked from other side as well, and I'm going to take them out of the plate. This is how the other side will look. Likewise, make all the fritters. 